Good morning, everyone. It is Thursday, October 5th, and I'm getting to school about 10 after 7. I literally feel like I just left here. I got no grading done. Ian and I watched a weird movie last night called The Bad Batch. It's on Netflix. If you're not into gory or like cannibalism, like I'm not into that, feel free to watch it. But I, if you're not into that, like, like it, just don't watch it. I mean, it was weird. Really, really weird. Um, like I said, I'm just getting to school. I didn't get any grading done needed to come in early. I did go to McDonald's to get a nice coffee. And I have to say, McDonald's, this is like milk with coffee, but I'm not complaining. I really wish they made like coffee flavored milk. And if they do, that, I mean, that's weird too, but let me know because I love a lot of cream and milk in my coffee. That's just how I like it. I realized as I was pulling up here, I totally forgot my lunch walked right out of the house without grabbing a salad and I usually have pre-made salads and they're all just ready to go in the refrigerator and I completely walked out and forgot to get one. Thankfully today's a half day and I can run out after all my meetings. I'm going to be starving so I'm probably going to munch on some candy. I have Skittles in my classroom which isn't a good thing but it's what I have. I don't know what else to do. Um, I could go out during my lunch. Maybe I'll do that. We have a Dairy Queen here and I've been trying to have those pretzel sticks. Yes, Ian made fun of me the other day because apparently I never knew that they had pretzel sticks. But every time we go to Dairy Queen, I always mention, hey, they have pretzel sticks. I really should try them. I love bread. I love pretzel sticks. I want to try them. So maybe I'll do that today actually for lunch. It's a really good opportunity. It's a really good excuse for me to go to Dairy Queen and try their pretzel sticks. Me forgetting my lunch. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Ian, no, I did not do it on purpose. I'm going to go ahead inside and see what I can get done grading wise. I am all planned out for today's half day. It's going to be a breeze. We have an attendance breakfast with our principal this morning. Those students that were here every day, not signed in late, not checked out early, are able to have prints are able to have breakfast with our principal this morning. I have that list. I'm ready to go. We are just going to do some reading and math, maybe make up a little bit of science, maybe. I don't know if we're going to get to that today. And then we literally go from specials, lunch, recess, and have a half an hour at the end of the day. And I think we're just going to do centers and pack up and leave. Go home. So I'll check in with you guys later. So I came home after school. I really didn't want to stay longer than I had to because today we had a half day. I left about three o'clock after realizing that I hadn't eaten. I knew I forgot my lunch, but I didn't eat anything today. So I stopped at Dairy Queen and picked up some like chicken fingers and I finally got to have those pretzel sticks and oh my gosh, they are so good. And we're going to be having them a lot. Oh really, I really like the pretzel sticks. I got home and I realized that I have mail from the blue envelope. I'm so excited. So I'm going to quickly open it and show you guys what I got. All right, so how freaking cute is this bag? I love the navy blue bow that this comes in, and I love that I can see their business card and an information card, and my shirt is right behind it. This is packaged so beautifully. I love things that are packaged cute, and people take the time to appreciate their customers and their purchase. So inside is their business card. Ugh. Ian would tease me because he knows what I'm thinking about this business card right now. It is aesthetically appealing to me. He taught me that word. All right, and this is their information card. Very cute. And this is the shirt that I got. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. It is, if you're familiar with LuLaRoe, it is from um, a long sleeve tee, kind of like the Randy. Um, but I did get a black sleeve with white body and it says second grade on it. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. How cute and perfect timing for tomorrow. I can totally wear this tomorrow for payday. Yay! I don't know if I should though because it is long sleeves. But how stinking cute. Again, I got this from the Blue Envelope totally recommend them. So the blue envelope also has other t-shirts available. I truly recommend going to their website and finding which t-shirt you like best and purchasing from them. They're so soft and I can't wait to wear it. They're very eye-catching. I love the little words and the adjectives that describe teaching and second grade and just primary grade level in general. I'm really excited to wear it and I think we'll get a lot of compliments from it. So I'm definitely going to be recommending the blue envelope to everyone that likes my t-shirt tomorrow. 
On my way home, I was texting my mom asking her to help me with grading. Grading is not going to take me that long because in the primary grades, the content is easier, just a little bit. So I am going to have her help me with grading because it just, I have things to do and her grading my papers really helps me. I do look over them and like submit them into the grade book myself, but the actual like marking right or wrong she does for me, which I think is okay as a teacher. We all should be looking at our own graded work um, just to see progress and um, any type of growth or reteaching that we need to do for our kiddos. But essentially my mom is the one that I get sometimes when I'm cramped like this to do the right and wrong answers and like multiple choice, things like that. Any type of work that I can provide her with an answer key, she's willing to grade. And then I go back and I put it in the grade book and I look over their worksheet once I get it in my hands. Since today was a half day, I should have had time to do professional responsibilities, but I just didn't. We had a mentor mentee meeting at the end of the day and then I had a meeting with my principal. So it, there just was not any time. And I went back to my room and I tried to do stuff, but it was already 2.30 and I just kept thinking about food and the clock was counting down for me to leave. I just really needed to get out of there. So I'm gonna spend time grading papers until my mom gets home from work. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Oh, and I almost forgot to show you guys my shirt that I wore today was Get Your Cray On. It's so cute. I think I got it from Amazon and it was very fitting for today because I had another child from another grade level come and join my classroom today. And it just was really funny because this was the shirt that I chose to wear. Like. How fitting. Okay, not looking at the screen for that one or the camera for that one. My bad. But I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Bye.